10 affirmations a day. Hey y'all, it's Audrey and welcome back to my channel. So I know y'all see the vest on. Your girl literally just clocked out. I clocked out at 2.02 and it's currently 2.06 and I'm currently just got in my car and started it up. As you know, I live in Illinois. It's cold outside and it was snowing today. So, with that being said, I'm going to take you through my slight daily routine of when I get off work. And what I do when I get off work, and tomorrow I'm actually off work, so I might vlog a little bit tomorrow because all I'm doing tomorrow is doing hair. But tonight I have to prep the wig and everything. So, yeah, why not? I said I'm gonna learn to start vlogging more. So, with that being said, here we are today, here we are right now. So, Right now, I'm just waiting on my car to warm up because I don't have an automatic starter and I don't get my automatic starter installed until March. I got a whole nother month of this. So, yeah, I have to go pick up some food. When I get there, I'm, uh, um, I'm probably not going to vlog that because I have to go pick up some food. I'll probably let y'all know what I'm getting. My mom wants racks tonight. It's like a roast beef restaurant out here in Joliet. If you know, you know. So I'm probably going to get that. Well, I'm not probably, but I am going to go get that and then head home. Because I have to go home and meet my friend at my house. Because she has to pick up this lash remover because she got her lashes done and she did not like them like when i say she does not like them i mean she hates them so with that being said let's hit the road sis i will check back in with y'all probably nine or ten when i get home so as you can see your girl is home don't mind my duncan logo on this shirt girl at walmart we're not allowed to wear hoodies and i still have this shirt when I worked there for like two or three years ago, I don't know. So I just wear this to work now. So now that I'm home, I actually like the first thing I like to do is take my sh shower. So we're about to go get in the shower, and and then I'll show you guys my usual routine after I get out the shower. And then we also got a package. So I'm gonna open that package right here in front of y'all. And then we're gonna go ahead in the shower. And then I'll show you guys what I usually do afterwards. But this is the package. But how have y'all been? Your girl been kind of just learning and just sitting with herself lately. Just not escaping the world, but I've really just been learning to love myself a little bit more. Taking every day, a day by day process, like, and trying not to just focus it on me a little bit more. Uh, Aside from outside of other people. Because I have a tendency. I have a tendency to just like worry about other people. That's not myself. And that's why I mess up all the time. But. Mm -hmm. So extra. So you guys. I bought a new glue. I bought the Bold Hold uh, Active Alonzo Arnold Edition. It's supposed to smell like lemonade or a lemon juice. It's supposed to smell like some lemon. It actually smells good. 
because I feel like the boho that I bought from the beauty supply store was actually a fake boho and I feel like that's probably why it never stuck and it probably just was breaking me out so bad and this was actually an accidental purchase and I couldn't cancel it once I had ordered it so it's kind of like whatever and then I also bought the boho um tape because sometimes I don't always want to use lace adhesive like if I tell y'all how many times I be wanting to put a wig on but I don't want to go through that process of doing lace adhesive and I don't want to go through that whole process of spraying and I just want to put the tape on put the wig on and go that's why I bought these right here the tape because I ain't got time for it so I'm probably going to do a wig install video featuring that pretty soon, hopefully. Um, but with that being said, let's go prepare to go get in the shower and then go from there. Oh yeah, one more thing I do like to do before I get into the shower is I like to light a candle this one is practically gone so i'm actually gonna throw this out because there's i don't think there's really a point of me even trying to light this but you know what i might keep it just in case it might light again so i don't know i i have a huge collection of bath and body works candles now so that being said we're gonna pick a new candle today and just do it based off my mood because usually i try to burn candles that's already like halfway burnt but today i'm just really not in the sense for the candles that's already burned so i'm just gonna burn a new one today Lately, I've just been in the mood for like, um, the smell of eucalyptus. I don't know why, but that's the mood we're going for today. So, we're actually going to burn we're going to burn this beautiful candle right here. Eucalyptus Snowfall. And it smells so good. And then I'm also going to put water into my diffuser. And then I'm going to put eucalyptus and peppermint into that one. Ladies, don't forget to trim your wicks because I trim these down. So now I'm just going to light it. This candle just looks so pretty. Like, I love this candle. I think I more so love this candle because of the art of the candle. But this candle is so pretty. Like. Mm -mm. So now I'm about to just get my oil diffuser. And go ahead and put some water into that. If it doesn't already have water in there. Because I filled it up yesterday. And just turned it on. So, I'm going to check that. So, I actually still do have water in my diffuser. So, now I'm just going to lay out my other stuff. And I'm sorry if y'all hear noise in the background. My mom is currently washing clothes. And, um... Is it just me or y'all skin is like peeling really bad like when I say bad I mean bad like my friend was doing my nails shout out to Issa 
This is the latest sale that we did before she goes to Mexico. So, she was doing my nails and I thought I had dust on my arms. Girl, no. My skin was literally peeling. Like, I hate the winter. I hate it because that is the time of the year I get the driest. And right now, it's been snowing a lot lately. So, right now, I'm nothing but completely dry skin. Like, I, my skin looked like reptile skin. Like, that's how bad it was. So, yesterday when I got home from work and got in the shower, I did exfoliate. So, I think I want to do the same thing today. Because, yeah. I mean, yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm back. I'm out the shower. So, my lips feel dry. So, I'm just putting on some chapstick. And lip gloss. This is one of my favorite lip glosses. It is the Black Radiance Clear Gloss. Honey. Top tier. Better than your regular hair store lip gloss. And you can fight me if you think I'm lying. So now that we are out the shower, we feel good, we feel refreshed. We're gonna head over to my vanity area and we're gonna sit down and do my usual routine of when I get off work. So I really have really bad lighting in my room. So I usually have to turn on my ring light. So I usually sit here for the first part of my day like usually when i get off work i try to avoid getting on social media like unless i'm having a really bad day and i just want to get in bed like i don't want to face reality then sometimes i might get on my phone and just do other things that i know i shouldn't do but i still do it so with that being said i have three different things I like to do when I get off work. So I have my book that I like to read, Thinking Girl Rich. I usually try to read two to three pages a day, three or four. It really just depends on my mood. Um, when I get off work, I usually try to read this. And then I also try to read it before I go to bed. But sometimes that doesn't always happen because Sometimes I get too sleepy and too tired. And when I feel like I'm too sleepy and too tired, I feel like I can't comprehend when I read. So I choose not to read because anything I read out of this book, I actually want to take heed to it. And I actually want to take the knowledge out of this book. And that's also why I have highlighters. So some things that pop out to me, I will highlight within this book. And then I have my affirmation journal. So... Some people may think, well, you should do your affirmations in the morning. I feel like you should do your affirmations whenever you feel like it. Affirmations should not. You could say affirmations in the morning when you first wake up. But okay, for some reason, my camera keeps cutting off and I don't realize it. But as I was saying, I feel like you should be able to write your affirmations whenever. In the morning, at, at the end of the day, whenever. Just as long as you write them and you say them out loud, whether it's in the morning, at night, long as you say your daily affirmations, that's what matters the most, in my opinion. But as for this, this is my daily journal. So this is the journal I write in at the end of every day. Whether I had a good day, bad day, if I feel some type of way, anything that happened today, I write in this journal right here. Your 
10 affirmations a day. I do more than 10 because I actually say some when I first wake up in the morning to myself before I go to work when I'm in the mirror brushing my teeth. So I say more than 10 affirmations a day. Okay, I got tuna. So don't mind me. Your girl ain't eat all day. Your girl literally go to work and don't eat nothing. So, yeah. But I highly, highly, highly recommend that you guys get that book because that book always puts me in a better mindset after I read it. Especially if you have goals that you want to attain, especially if those goals involve money, it will help you elevate your mindset even more. So, I highly, highly, highly recommend that book. I've had that book for over a year and I'm just now picking it up. I honestly wish I would have picked it up and read it when I first got it, but it wasn't time. It wasn't my time. But now it's kind of like, it's my time to get up and do better for myself. So, hey y'all. It is the following morning. And I didn't do nothing I was supposed to do yesterday. And I mean nothing. But part of that was my... I, I take... Well, of course it's my fault, but... I was on the phone all day yesterday with Salali, catching up with her. If you watched my fashion show vlog, you know exactly who I'm talking about. So, right now, I'm sitting here bleaching the wig. And then, um, I just finished writing my daily affirmations. So, now I'm going to go brush my teeth, wash my face, and come back in here and read my book. And then get the day started. turkey bacon and cinnamon toast sticks I do have avocado that I needed to use before I went bad so I'm just eating that with everything and that's gonna be my breakfast for today and after I finish my breakfast then I gotta get on the computer and start editing 
so my video can be up by tomorrow. So with that being said, let's get this show on the road. Personally, I like the butterball turkey bacon. So we're about to put this in the pan, start frying it. And then next thing we know, we're gonna do the eggs. The cinnamon toast sticks, all I gotta do is put them in the microwave and call it a day. So this is what my breakfast is looking like. Something simple, something slight. And I just wanna sit down and be transparent with y'all. If y'all heard stuff in the background while I was talking downstairs, it's because I live with other people. I live with my mama, I live with my grandmother, and my brother comes in and out the house. So I have to tell myself, I have to remind myself, I don't live by myself. So sometimes there is going to be background noise. Sometimes there is going to be commotion in the background that you guys are going to hear. And I can't always have a house that's quiet 24-7 in order for me to film. And I feel bad about it. Like, I am a regular black woman that works a 9 to 5. Working to build towards something better for myself. And, or, and in order for me to get where I want to be I have to be comfortable and love where I am now and that's one thing I have to reflect on my YouTube channel because sometimes I want my videos to be so perfect and so me that sometimes I do forget like Girl, you don't live by yourself. You live with other people. So, it's not going to always be quiet in the house. You going to have interruptions in your video that you just going to have to edit out. Like, that's one of the things I had to come to the realization of when creating content. Like, it's a part of my life and I just have to take it for now. So, with that being said, I'm about to sit here, watch um, Bad Nana's new video, because she just posted a video yesterday, and get ready to edit this vlog from last week, which I'll be up by tomorrow. Yeah, I was the last minute. I am a procrastinator. I will not hold nobody. But I bet you I get it done. So hey y'all, right now I'm just getting a little snacky snack in. I had a potato. And don't mind the background. I'm on the phone with my friend. But um I am eating a potato that I had last night for dinner. And I just packed up my bag to go do her hair. So now I'm just about to just go get dressed. So then we could get ready to head out because I got to head out by 4 o'clock. And it is currently... What time is it? It is currently 3.06. So, I'm going to do this and then get ready to go. And y'all coming along with me, hoes. Yes, you are. So, hey, y'all. We back. And this is the fit for today. So, I'm simple, simple because we only going to go do hair. 
And this is the scent that I have on. I have on my, excuse me, Michael Kors 24K Gold. And I also paired it with this Victoria's Secrets Dream Angel. That's because I feel like the Michael Kors is a little strong. Like, when I say strong, baby, I mean strong. But, um... I like it, but I don't like it. It's one of those sense of your mammy can wear it, your granny can wear it, but you want to add something a little subtle with it. So, that's exactly what I did. So, with that being said, we're going to head on out and get ready to head towards Plainfield. I'm thinking about stopping to get Starbucks. <laughs> Do I need to go stop and get Starbucks? Because my big girl, no, but I haven't had a refresher in a really long time. <laughs> and I deserve it. I deserve it.